the pursuit of controlled powered man flight. Harvard assistant and Smithsonian secretary Samuel Pierpont Langley was contracted by the United States War Department to figure out this new mystical flying machine. The Wright brothers, on the other hand, did not have what some would see as Langley's recipe for success. They lacked college degrees, had a much smaller team, and were running off of what little funds were left over from their bicycle shop. But they were inspired and worked for the glory of mankind to take to the skies. They beat Samuel Pierpont Langley because they weren't in it for the money or personal gain. They knew that they could change the world. Much like the Wright brothers, I aspire to change the world and do so through the combination of engineering, politics, and business. Over 20% of every dollar I have ever earned has been invested in the future of space. I've used this money to travel all over the country, meeting some of the industry's greatest and brightest minds. This money has also funded campaigns to Washington, D.C., where I visited over 140 congressional, House, and Senate offices concerning issues of space policy reform. Upon attending ISDC 2012 at the age of 18, I watched SpaceX's Dragon capsule birth with the International Space Station alongside heroes of mine, including Buzz Aldrin, Charlie Bolden, and Eric Anderson. I became inspired. It is this inspiration, combined with 14 years of dreaming about working on rockets, that has brought me to this application. SpaceX has and will continue to be the end goal.